Hello, I am Dr. Mazhar Khan Mulla. I am consultant neurosurgeon practicing in Narpada, Mumbai. I will speak in brief about epilepsy and its treatment and management. Epilepsy, also known as seizure disorder, means multiple or recurrent episodes of seizure or fits. There can be multiple causes of seizures depending upon different age groups. In pediatric population, febrile seizures are due to very high fever. Seizures are very common in neonates and infants. Developmental abnormalities like some birth trauma leading to hypoxia of the brain and developmental uh, disorders may lead to epileptic disorders in children. Metabolic causes like decreased calcium or sugar may lead to epileptic disorders or seizures. In adults, head injury, road traffic accident leading to brain hematoma or brain injury are also common causes of seizures. Brain tumors or uh, some infections like encephalitis, bacterial viral uh, infection, tuberculosis or even uh, parasitic infections like neurosis or pesis are very common causes of epilepsy in India. The management of epilepsy involves uh, detailed history taking and examination by a neurospecialist doctor like neurophysician or neurosurgeon and if required followed by some investigations like MRI, EEG and after all these investigations and history examination the root cause of epilepsy is tried to be found out once the cause of the epilepsy or seizures is found, it is treated like for example tumor or hematoma is found, it can be surgically removed if indicated and anti-epileptic drugs are also started. There are various types of anti-epileptic drugs for the control of seizures or epilepsy. Depending upon the patient's age and various factors, specific anti-epileptic drug is started by the neurospecialist doctor to the patient. Sometimes some patients require single drug, sometimes they may require more than one drug for the control of the seizures. Now, uh, in spite of that, sometimes patients might have recurrent episodes of seizures. What are, what are the aggravating factors of these episodes of epilepsy? Due to most common factor is uh, not taking medicine on time, called as non-compliance. Patients have to take anti-epileptic drugs every day at the prescribed time, at the prescribed day by their uh, neurospecialist doctors. Along with that, inadequate sleep, improper diet, tension, stress, mental trauma, excessive alcohol intake, all these factors may lead to uh, recurrent episodes of seizures in spite of medication. Now, uh, how to manage an episode of seizure? There are many myths attached with, uh, attached with it. Myths like some people use onion or keys to control epilepsy. Usually most of the seizure or epileptic episode uh, usually resolve within 2 minutes but uh, what we have to do is if you see a patient having epileptic attack we have to keep him in the lateral position loosen up all his, uh, his uh, shirts or clothes so that he can breathe properly and just wait for 2 minutes it will automatically resolve and then start his anti-epileptic medicine sometimes if seizure episode is not resolved within 2 or 5 minutes it is called a status, then it is a medical emergency. The patient has to be immediately shifted to a hospital where injections of the anti-epileptic drugs uh, has to be started to control this epilepsy. These are the actually myths uh, attached with the, uh, this uh, disorder and usually this episode, uh, this uh, epilepsy is treated with proper taking of the anti-epileptic drugs on time as prescribed by the doctors and if there is any recurrence have to immediately report to their neurosurgeon doctor and start the uh, revised treatment thank you